hello guys in this video we are going to learn how to detect moisture content in soil using 8051 for doing this i will be using a special library of protease which is soil moisture sensor so let's see what is what is soil moisture sensor and how does it work well soil moisture sensor is used to measure the humidity of moisture or it is used to measure the moisture content in soil you can use it to measure water level by using multiple moisture sensors so it has two parts the first one is electronic circuit on the right hand side of the sensor it is used to adjust the sensitivity and on the left hand side it consists of two probes which we place in soil the sensor can measure the levels of moisture in the soil so it can be extremely useful if you want to monitor the soil moisture of your plants or automate the watering procedure so let's suppose i have one cup of dry soil with me if i place the sensor in the cup we can read a low moisture value on the display the reason why it shows this is because uh, the conductivity between the probes of the sensor is low as a result of low water content now if i pour some water in the cup you will see that the moisture levels rise as a result of good conductivity between the probes but this de demonstration is not possible in protease and so we have a test pin connected to the to the sensor which is connected to a pot so if i vary this pot for high resistance value the conductivity will be less and so the voltage at the analog output will be more we can set a threshold or uh, threshold in order to enable the digital output at a certain moisture level using this pot given given with electronics part of sensor so the soil moisture has four pins the first one is vcc it is supplied with five volts and the second one is ground this is grounded then the third one is analog output pin it is given to the port or you can use it to uh, to convert it in the uh, digital form then the fourth pin is test pin it is connected to the port it uh, like if we vary this port the that means the resistance if you vary that means the sensitivity is varying sensitivity varies of the probes then the analog output i told like it is connected to the it gives the voltage ac voltage ac occurred across the probes and it is directly proportional to the sensitivity now we shall see what are the connections made for this project so in this project i have used 889c5 and microcontroller an lcd an lcd to display the moisture content an adc to convert the analog output obtained from moisture sensor into the digital form and this soil sensor i have used then some basic basic connections i have done to provide the clock uh, to provide the clock to microcontroller i have used two capacitors of 33 microfarad then a crystal oscillator of 11.0592 megahertz then to provide resetting of microcontroller we have used here capacitor of 10 microfarad and then a resistor of 10 ohms and at last the push button is used so that's it that's it with the connections now the lct is connected to the port 1 through its data pins then its rs rw and enable pins are connected to port port p2 you can see now coming to adc i have used here adc 0804 that has a resolution of 8 bit its data pins are connected to port number 3 port number 3 is connected to the adc then the read pin and read pin right pin and interrupt pin these are connected to port 2 now the vcc its vcc pin is connected to the output analog output of uh, the sensor through some co basic connections i have done here 
so like that's it and i am assuming that you are already aware with the working of lct and adc so i don't need to like elaborate the working also now so we are done with uh, circuit diagram now we shall get down to the code so this is the code so firstly including the header file reg51.h then string.h also including then the lcd which is connected to port p1 it is also defined then the data pins like uh, the adc is connected to port 3 so i have defined that one also then the pins of lcd and adc are connected sorry they are defined they are they are all connected to port 2 then these are the user defined functions then L delay function it is used to provide the delay using for loop cmd function is used to set up the lcd then l data function is used to write the uh, write the data to lcd then adc function it converts the digi it converts the analog output analog um, data to digital data so whatever digital data is converted it will be in the form of in it will be in the um, port 3 so that digital data will be passed to some temporary variable which is adc i have defined here and this will be returned to some other variable in main function so now coming to string function it uh, like it writes alphabetical characters or data to lcd then coming to main function i have defined some temporary variables uh, you can skip this in i and j then setting up the uh, lcd using these commands then in the first uh, first line i will write moisture content then in the second line i will display the value so coming to second line the input is kept at uh, in on condition the adc value like uh, the fun the function adc it will return some well digital data so that will be passed to some temporary variable that is temp adc data which i have declared here then if the date if this digital data is greater than zero then we will uh, pr uh, digit by digit we will print it on the lcd by using these commands so that's all so that's how we uh, write the data to lcd and so the value will be displayed so that's all with the code now now we shall create the hex file hex file has been created i have named the hex file as soil.hex so it uh, importing it in the a0 open ok so starting the simulation now after 10 delay after a delay of 10 milliseconds it, it is displaying the value for different re resistors uh, resistance value it will show different values and this is the analog input analog output sorry an analog output of sensor and this is the digital output of sensor uh, you can make it stable like uh, you you are seeing like the value is differing a lot so you can use some div uh, div divider like voltage divider circuit across the pin v in plus so that you can get a stable output otherwise it is fine like uh, the result is also different because we are using here 8 bit resolution adc for 16 bit or 32 bit the va value might change if i va vary this the moisture content also varies for higher value it it should it should show the higher value of moisture content then 
that's it it varies like uh, too much it varies you can use voltage divider tool as i said thank you so much for watching this video thanks so much